it's crazy how like during the season there's like obviously this is gonna happen and that's yeah. gonna happen and then it gets to the end and there's way less people and it's so many more options so it's so yeah like it's in the competitions are so much more important because like your friendships and social game and alliances can't get you any for can't mm -hmm. it's up to you at this yeah. point and it's up to you to make the right move and um it's a lot of back and forth and uncertainty right now like I don't know what the best move is for me, and I'm just, I got, like, what, five hours and less than four hours to figure it out. Mm -hmm. And I'm just trying to be, like, as honest and upfront with it. I'm not trying to be sneaky at all. I'm just no, it's telling you exactly where my head's at. Like, um, There's no point in being sneaky at this time. Yeah, like, like, that's just, bottom line is... Because the relationship's still, like... Mm -hmm. Relationship management continues to help you get further. Yeah, you know? for sure. Like, you getting the final three, mm -hmm. like... That's what I need, and then it's in my hands, literally. Yeah. Like, it's it's all up to me. I can't depend on someone to take me there. Right. Um, and so... And the fact that I don't get... To, so everyone else gets to play two competitions to try to solidify themselves in final three i play one and so i'm freaking out and i'm also like feel very alone and i'm just like what can i do there's something i can do to make my chances better and just like i think getting out someone that's good at competitions is my best bet like i i that's no no shit i would do the same yeah thing. that's that's the only thing that I can think of. Because it increases your... Not only are you increasing your odds by the numbers, mm -hmm. but you're increasing your odds by the... Like, yeah. taking out the best. Yeah. And, and the thing is, is if I... I don't think it's good to initially put up the two best. I think it's good to go for one. And then if that one comes down, then make a different move, if that makes sense. Yeah. Because if I put them both up, one's gunning for me... They will not keep me next week if they come down and one staying. And also, that could say, like, Enzo won veto. He could pull Cody down, then you're forced to go up anyway. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? And then they'll might spite me and vote you out because I put up Cody. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So I'm trying to think of what is... But do you think that that... I mean, like, at this point, so many mm -hmm. people... Like, we're, we're all... We're, we're in this game. This isn't our first time. We're not no. yeah. playing emotionally. No. You know? But I mean, they. Who knows if there's? They have deals that we. I don't know about. I have no idea. So I know a lot of. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Trust me. As much as I wanted to win this one, I was fucking dreading this position yeah. to not be able to play next week. Yeah. And to like sit there and look at everybody and mm -hmm. the people that I would want to bring with me. There's no guarantee right now. Right. You know, like, I... I don't have a vote. I don't have a vote this week. I do. If, if it's 1-1, one, one, awesome. Like, I can control what I want to happen. But I don't have a freaking vote either, and I can't play next week. So yeah. I have to figure out how do I get... Like, how... Yeah, it's hard. There's, yeah, <laughs> it, it hurts your brain. Yeah. It does. It really does. There's um, so many different... I mean, honestly... It almost, the, excuse me, 